Welcome back everyone to another video today on the channel. I know it's been a couple of days since I last posted, but I'm back on the grind. Back here on Fortnite. I know it's probably been a bit of time before I last did a Fortnite video. So today, um, this one's going to be a bit different because... Um, We are not playing on the actual map that we have now for chapter four. Like, if you already know, there's been like like things for PC that people can make, like maps and stuff like from like creative and stuff like that, with like new materials and stuff, aka Creative 2.0 that Epic Games have added. They're going to soon add it to console, I think. But um, there's a map that I really want to play. And it got made, like, pretty recently. So let's get into it. So um, the map code will be 2179 7822 So what this map code would do is bring you up to this Atlas OG Battle Royale. Yeah, if you if you could tell what this is from the image, this is the chapter one I owned. And we just put it on public. But um actually not public, private. So I could just check around. See if it's the exact replica of the first map. But yeah, um We have not seen this map in in about four years. So it's going to be interesting returning back to it after many years of just roaming through seasons and maps. So it's going to be interesting seeing it in 2023. This map is in beta. Okay. Please report all bugs to... I didn't even get to see it. But yeah, um, if you could tell, this is the spawn island that you, we used to spawn on, the chapter one island. Like, you can literally see the original battle bus over there. Uh, that's just mental. Bro, it's even got the original music. Oh, oh my days. Like, you can literally see the island over there. Don't tell me that's Flush Factory. No way. Like, if I go to view the map now, it, yeah. I don't know whether this is just a bug or not. But. Right. It's even got a cutscene. Yeah, that's literally like Flush Factory and stuff. Bro. This brings back so many memories. Uh, you can literally tell this is chapter one, season three. You can literally tell because it's got um, lucky landing over there. But yeah, this is literally uh, before the whole um, meteor hitting Dusty Depot right there. But yeah, right. the islands are pretty much the same, I think. Can't really tell, but where should we land? No, let's land up some good old salty springs. Bro, it's literally got the watchtower. That is mental. Is it still got the chest in the roof? Bro, the graphics for this look insane. It's even got a chest right here. Oh my days. Yeah, they've literally fallen and recreated the chapter one island. That is just mental. That is absolutely mental. Yeah, that might, that might be a bug. I'm not sure. Like, I don't think you can ride, um, like drive cars or anything in this. No. 
it's literally the exact same as the chapter one map besides you know the the skin that i'm wearing and the running animation from when this map used to look like this I uh, forgot what this building was. But, you know, uh, you got the factory place. I had no idea what this was called either. But I swear this place got um, turned into something at some point. Has it still got the disco area, eh? If it's this area, anyways. Or if it had the disco area at this time. I think it might be this building. I can hear a chest, but I'm not even going to open it. No, it's just... It's just this. Okay. Um, right, where to next? Retail roll. Oh my days. Yeah, for the people that have um, played this season back, like, or this chapter back then, you um, would obviously remember every place from like this map. Like, as soon as you actually see it, you'll just instantly just remember it. Like, I think the graphic, well, not the graphics, um, the grass looked the same. Yeah, you know, you've got that car there. Is it? Yeah, it's still got the little shopping centre. Yeah, tacos. I want the first storm circles coming in. Yeah. Oh, I, I haven't got that long to play in this map. Why is there just a random gun here? I mean, I'll, I'll, I'll take it. I mean, I'll, I'll take the tack shotgun as well. I'll happily take the tack shotgun and the original scar before... Um, I think it was either chapter 4 or... Right, I'm pulling my pickaxe out. That noise is irritating. It's even got the little watchtower near Sawyer. Bro, I've landed at that an awful lot of times during the original map. It's unreal. I think I used to land there half the games that I played. But there was one spot in particular that I proper loved. One of the best places known to man on this game. Even though it, it may look sharp, but the loot you can get from it is absolutely amazing. Ooh, hunting rifle. Don't mind if I grab that to see for from distances. Oh, I'm actually really impressed with these graphics. Right, what have I got from this? Um, cold, cozy campfires. Okay. Attack SMG, no way. I'm saying with these campfires. Can you literally just place a like a floor down? And have the and just place the campfire on it all. I'm gonna test that. Y you literally can. You need 30 more wood to stoke. Okay. I have not got the wood to stoke it and yeah, I don't think I will stoke it. Yeah, for some weird reason, them mountains seems like a, a lot bigger than what they used to be. I don't know if that's me or just this map, but yeah. Uh, I can literally tell what place is over there and what is over here. Uh, welcome to the wonderful world of Loot Lake, everyone. Oh, 
I'm okay. I always could cut out of anything hot while I'm sprinting. Because it's hurting my ears with the pickaxe noise and stuff that comes off when, I'm, when I go to sprint. Yep, you got the little boat in the water. You've even got all them houses. Oh, I can't even view all the, the storms there. Wait, oh, I'm literally just running on the water. Okay. That never used to be a thing. Well, I mean, until chapter one, season six, where you got Kevin the Cube invading the entire water. But, yeah. Uh. I know Junk Junction used to be up there, and I mean it still is on this map, but I forgot what um, the other place near it was. The little graveyard place. Crap. The place used to be so dead I genuinely forgot the name of the place. Is Snobby Shores still over here? As well as Pleasant, Pleasant Park. Oh, yep. Pleasant Park's still here because I can literally see a building. Can I get a chance to see it before the next circle comes in? I won't be able to see Snobby Shores from here. I Let's go, you got that like, gas station. Um, have you still got that like, football pitch? Yep. And all the buildings around it. Gotta love Pleasant Park. And plus what I saw earlier when that we had that cutscene was one of my favourite places. Like pretty much everyone that played the game in back in like 2017, 2018 should pretty much know what Moist Meyer is. I know the, the place is a bit dead, but there was a place right near it that that used to land pretty much every game. And hopefully, if I can, I don't think I will, I'd be able to like see it. I guarantee that won't happen with the storm circle closing in. But yeah, it's literally um it's a prison. It used to be one of my favourite landing spots back then with like playing with like my cousins and stuff like that. It used to be like so good back then, but now they you know, this is back out. Just out of existence. Same with Tilted. Like back to its former glory with its buildings not being struck down but it being replaced with the no sweat insurance building. It's good to know. At least this place is not what it was like on Chapter 3. I mean, I loved Tilted Towers in Chapter 3 but not as much as this version of it. For some weird reason, this version of Tilted Towers just seems better, in a way. I don't know. I mean, we've had many versions in the past for Tilted. We had, um, um I think it's not Mega City, because um, I think Mega City, this chapter is another version of Tilted. But yeah, we've had the original Tilted, which is that one there. Um, we've had, um, well, I wouldn't say it's a version of Tilted, but it's similar to it. Gotham City, back in Season X of Chapter 1. Um, we've had Neo Tilted. Yeah, I won't be able to reach Salty Springs or anything now. Um, is there anywhere else I could search? I'll say, I don't think I'd be able to. But um, there was 
uh, another place, I think. Yeah, there was. Um, what was that western place? Oh, it's just completely flew past my mind. But, um, yeah, if you just want to um, hop into this map and view every location for yourself, um, the code is literally 2179 7822 3395. If you want to pause the video or anything to get the code, then that's completely fine. It should be the code will be at the beginning of the video, anyways. So if he's want to pause, then I'll go back to it. It's you can do that, but yeah, this has been me viewing the chapter one island. I, I not view it viewed it all, but I viewed what I could with the storm closing in. But um, yeah, um, as the storm closes in and probably takes me out, I'll I'll be going so make sure you leave a like subscribe and yeah if you want to see me view the rest of the map then comment in the comment section below right, see ya